Hello, welcome back to 1001 Beers You Must Try Before You Die. I am here actually in the Black Sheep Brewery uh, in Masson in Yorkshire. Probably hear things clustering away behind us here. And I've actually got this one beer from Black Sheep in the book, which we're here to review. It's only available on the car, so I thought well, we're about to actually have it if it's actually in the brewery itself. And this is Black Sheep Best Bitter. Um, I haven't got the book with me, but I do have all the tasting notes from here. It's off the brewery website, in fact, it says. This is the original stalwart of the Black Sheep range. It was first brewed in 1992. Uh, it's the iconic Yorkshire bitter, uh, devised and created to offer beer with real flavour and bite, a different breed. Um, so this is with the whole flower English hops. Uh, it's, it packs a genuine spiky bitterness of big character. Oh, they're over seven, isn't it? Challenger Goldings and Fuggle hops. Uh, blend to create a beautiful aroma and flavour with kicks of grassy freshness and a big peppery punch. Uh, Marisata malt, that's what the beers have, uh, and it's with an amber gold colour. So, this is about the aroma as well. So, you're looking like an amber gold colour. I mean, this is fresh, properly fresh beer, not going to have a better quality than this. Aroma, peppery with a delicate grassy freshness. Let's try that. I get the grassiness, I don't really get the pepperiness though. Um, but it's a nice beer, obviously I've got it in the half pint glass from the brewery itself. Uh, we're, we're here in the upstairs sort of lounge area. Do you want to just pan across and show us? We've got a nice fire here and it's all very Christmassy. It's a few weekends before Christmas here. So um, it says tasting, kicks of fresh English hops and a touch of pepper. I've never had pepperiness before with this, but let's give it a go. Cheers. Interestingly, I am now getting better. This is the best I've ever had this beer. I've had this beer so many times before, off from cars and other pubs. This is the best you're ever going to have. Um, it's exactly how we should be, it just shows how a lot of pubs are actually not serving the way it should be. Um, nice little bit of hoppiness to it, very kind of not too overly malty, it's quite light. It has got kind of like a spicy, pe peppy, peppery mustard, which is very nice. Nice and cellar cooled. Um, that is really nice actually. The best one I've ever remembered before. Better than, better than various kinds of palette. Uh, I don't think there's anything else to say about it really. I mean, obviously, you know, about the story of Black Sheep, this is the first bit they actually did. It's, a off, it's kind of an offshoot from the Feaston Brewery, which we've been to before this. Um, it, says it goes well with tender red meat and delicious roast lamb. Um, uses torrified wheat. It's always 3.8 percent, by the way, uh, from England, uh, uh, Mazam in Yorkshire, uh, Black Sheep Best Bitter. Not much to say about it, so I'm going to leave it there and go enjoy some more of the Black Sheep beers. I'll see you for another beer review soon.